Hello and welcome back to Let's Try. This is going to be a very strange one. It's going to be, um, I'll say a minefield uh, to navigate for myself personally on an ethical basis. Uh, I'm going to try my best and we're going to we're going to push the envelope a little bit of, of <laughs> what I do on my channel. But um, I, I wouldn't do this unless I thought it was actually kind of worth it. Um, this is this is Farlight 84. It's got one of the most generic names of all time, and I don't even know why it's called that. It's a battle royale. Um, you can leave now, honestly. <laughs> like if if you're not into battle royales, you're not gonna like this game. I don't think. If you are into battle royales, you're probably not gonna want to play this game anyway, because you probably have your pick for whatever battle royale you want to play. You're either playing PUBG or you're playing Fortnite or you're playing one of the other gajillion battle royales out there of whatever Warzone. Um, I played a little bit of Warzone. I am kind of tepid on battle royales of a 50-50 kind of, uh, you know, occasionally I get the urge to play one if one like, you know, oh, there's a new one and it, it looks like it could be okay. Is the is the gunplay good? No. Is the competitive nature of it good? No. Are, is the, you know, the, the player toxicity high? Yes. But uh, so why am I even like showing this it's a battle royale it's like 50 other bajillion battle royales does is it very innovative kinda let's jump into it i'll tell you why i'm talking about this game it's good i mean it's just good um like that's really the end of it um i've i've been playing it off and on uh over the weekend it kind of uh came out in like a free beta it's it's just it's a free to play game and it comes with the you know all of the predatory uh you know microtransactions and battle passes and and this is and that's that you can imagine that a free to play battle royale comes with um and you know like my skepticism was extremely high but as i say occasionally i get the urge to try one of these games and see if I'm, you know, going to like it. And I found myself really enjoying it. Um, strangely, I, I don't know what to what to say. The gunplay actually is good. Um, the actual like, you know, it, it's just it's just fun. It's got some vehicles in it. It's got um, different characters that you, you can select. I just unlocked this guy. I guess I'll try and uh, play someone I've already played before so that I can actually play the, the game competently and show the game off a little bit. Um, all of these characters have, a, a, well, I, I don't want to say slight flavor because it makes it sound like they're very samey. They're a little bit samey, but they do have their own kind of uh, abilities that you can take advantage of. I mean, I've, I've grown to appreciate this character for their abilities, so I can't say that uh, they aren't you know they aren't exactly the same for sure um i'll explain how some of them work a little bit and i will say uh right now like if you're looking for really good play you don't you know gauge your expectations i am i'm very passing to middle to bad when it comes to these kind of games so i am the jet master um what that you know if you played apex you know what that means it means that your squad is going to be following you when you drop and i i like to wait a little bit because i don't necessarily go to like to go to a like a high octane zone and what we're gonna do is you can see our my squad mates are uh flying with me that's like automatic until they choose not to follow me any anymore someone's marked this base for me that's nice thank you i actually don't know what button it is to do call outs something I, I keep meaning to figure out but i'm not really playing this game to you know to care or to enjoy life you know <laughs> um so you know uh you're gonna be doing all the things that you know and love about a battle royale you're gonna jump down to a zone you're gonna go and collect some stuff Let's collect some guns you want to find any kind of gun so we've got here an uzi that's fine i don't mind the uzi it's it's a good one ish not a huge fan of the shotgun, at least not in this game. I've played other games that I enjoy the shotgun. I don't know what the range is even on it. You're going to be collecting shields. You're going to be collecting shield XP, which like over the course of the game will like passively upgrade your shield. There's uh, definitely some like nuance here and there that I, I basically ignore. 
Um, I think I prefer, actually, I don't know if I've used this MF-18. We could give it a go. It's a kind of like a semi-shot. It's not bad. You're going to be hearing these like little bleeps and bloops. They are basically little chests informing you that they are there. They're letting you know, hey, by the way, there's a chest here. Definitely going to want to go for all of these shields because that's going to be upgrading your shield over the course. And like, I won't, I'll, I'll be really blunt. It, it's Fortnite. It's just Fortnite again. This game is just Fortnite again, but it's on Steam and it doesn't suck. It's actually pretty good. I, I, I'm, I'm enjoying this game. Um, and it does like maybe one or two things that Fortnite does not do and it also like you know for better or worse it doesn't have 18 bajillion freaking uh franchise tie-ins maybe you like that about fortnite maybe you don't like that about fortnite but um i i could take it or leave it honestly so they, this guy is still down that means that they still have a squad mate hiding around somewhere Oh, no, maybe not. There's a 4X scope here. There's a 4X scope here. Arr. Yeah, I'll take the 4X scope. I don't think I can put that in on any of my guns. Can I put it on the... No, I, apparently I can't put it on the... Well, I took it anyway. I heard... So oh! Yeah, like I say... This person's made the unfortunate decision to uh, go and go for a swim and uh, ooh. Nice um, You basically you're no pun intended. You're a sitting duck when you're out in the lake um, You do have limited ammo some games like to play with that mechanic whether or not you have limited ammo or not Yes, there's limited ammo in this and I've run out quite often so it's something that you can do. There's a uh, various abilities. You're gonna see like a ton of like Different stuff you can do. You've got a shield. You've got health. You can recover both if you get like health kits and stuff like that um, I have abilities which I haven't used yet. I definitely like to use them circumstantially uh, What do we got here? Okay You can recover your your teammates one thing I will say I don't like about this game is how long it takes to recover your teammates and there's really not much benefit to do so i mean outside of a obvious like you know long-term strategy benefit like hey if you have teammates you're more likely to survive but i often find that my teammates will just never pick me up and i will find that i'm just not very encouraged to do the same and hey there's a guy there in a giant um spider mech thing let's let's see if we can't uh did they did they oh oh is that was that my teammate i thought it was someone else okay my bad um something i do appreciate about this game's very small quality of life thing is that your your character just kind of picks things up and auto upgrades whatever uh it is that you like you know if, if there's a better muzzle on the ground you don't have to pain painstakingly go through your inventory um, and and see what needs upgraded you can just your, your dude just like does it just just like upgrades your gun and You don't have to worry and you don't have to go through it and uh, I would just I realized that the circle is like here Okay Mega gill all right um, so we got the circle you might have noticed that I did a little bit of hopping around and I'll you'll notice that people do that They have a little you have like limited kind of jetpack, which is fun adds a little, uh, you know, a, a bit of extra mobility um, in town. Oh god Dominating yay, uh, that circle is right here. Oh good. Oh god. <clears throat> Don't want to be in the water. The water is bad. Water is real bad. Okay, we're out of the water. This is good. I need to upgrade my shield. We've only got like a level 3 shield. Definitely something you want to upgrade. And we also need to reload. 
But yeah, we're racing against the circle. I don't find the circle is super a problem. You know, like obviously you don't want to end up behind it. Um, but like I, I never never find it's like a lot of other battle rails. It was like, oh my god, the circle's coming and we're like, you know, we're not gonna make it, we're not fast enough. And yeah, you're you're pretty much fast enough. You don't it's not a huge problem. You don't really ever feel like you're in much danger. You can watch like I can you know, it's behind me, whatever, but Oh, maybe. Maybe I'm in a little bit of trouble. It's fine. We've got our jetpack. Uh, if we can get jump in one of those vehicles. I have tried desperately to have any kind of team play in this game where I've like, hey, you know, jump in, you know, jump in my car. Let's get in the car. Okay, well, they, they did, but I have often found that your teammates will just like ignore you. Um... Yeah, I mean, like, you can you can super count on the community in this game being fairly toxic. It's a battle royale, and I don't think that there's, there's a lot of room for uh, actual, like, friendly team play. Muzzle break. What do we got? We got... I heard a gunshot. It uh, The game is actually very good about letting you know <clears throat> that, like, there are people around you. This, uh, this tower is great. Um, a lot of people will hang out on this tower. It's a great vantage point. Um, oh. Saw them. I'll probably... Oh, yeah. So you can see, like, little markers. It'll let you know. Not just if, if you hear a gunshot. But also if you hear, like, footsteps and, like, also how close... I'm down. I'm down. Oh, crap. How close someone is you'll see those yellow footsteps <clears throat> so we'll see maybe if i eat my words here about my teammates i'm gonna oh he's coming never mind <laughs> uh buddy yeah i'm dead i don't need your pity so, um, there's a couple of things when it comes to, like, reviving your teammates. I'm pretty sure if I'm, like, dead dead, there's not really any way to bring me back. I don't know, though. It, it, like, I have the option of reminding my teammate. Hey, but remind them to do what exactly? I'm not exactly sure. Also, if you, uh, die in, the, like, the first few minutes of the game, apparently I, they can revive me for a little bit. Um... <clears throat> If you die in the first like couple minutes of the game, you can respawn, which is a nice little feature. So it that does a good job of you know making sure that each of your games is good. You know, you actually end up having a pretty good time because you don't like if you die in the first couple minutes, you don't just like oh that's it, that was your shot, blown, and you don't have to do uh you know the gulag whatever it's uh. You know, the little arena battle that Warzone does. Not that that's a bad way of doing things. I kind of like that as a, as a mechanic. But I also got kind of tired of it because people have like, you know, they master the gulag and then you, all you're all you're really doing is getting ended, uh, you know, killed um, with extra steps. You're just dying with extra steps. So it looks like my teammates have opted not to re revive me. Um, so I'm just going to go ahead and leave this. And we'll do uh, we'll do another game. I did pretty good, six kills. And you know, I have to say, I mean, this is very early in this game, so I'm definitely gonna enjoy this game more now than probably ever. Like this is the most I'm ever going to enjoy this game because uh, people have not just like 100% mastered it. It doesn't feel like I'm just going up against like uh, like 55 other ninjas. Um, so like, you know, I actually stand a chance and I can actually get some kills, which is something I don't find is true in any other uh, battle royale, mostly because I suck, but um, also because like everyone else is just really amazing at the game. Um, and I mean, like those are two different statements and I think that both can be true. Uh, and it's harder to get better at a game when everyone else has already, you know, perfected it. So I am going to, I'll do another, I'll do another round. There's other game modes in this game, but I know this is going to be the one that probably everyone, um, you know, 
uh, is is more attracted to and myself included this is the reason i pick, pick, picked up the game was to see if uh Friends. if it was any good so um i'm gonna try ember here this is a, a character I, I just unlocked so i wouldn't mind seeing what their deal is uh you might be wondering i mean one of the kind of novelty highlights of the game is like how are the vehicles are they fun are they you know fun to ride around in yeah they are actually pretty cool um there's at least a few vehicles that will actually transform um like either offering artillery um gunfire or like offering like a laser beam or offering a bit more mobility they're pretty cool they're faster than running um and uh the, the the actual like movement and you know physicality in this game feels good it, it's it's actually quite decent the way you move around in tanks and mechs and uh cars and stuff is uh is actually really decent it feels good it you know it, it doesn't feel janky and um it doesn't feel like just like a kind of like a unity asset flip no shade thrown at any specific game there but um you know like it, it actually feels good and it's it's got a cartoony art style for sure but like uh it works well i know it it, it just straight up looks like fortnite it, there's really no getting around that but i don't care because it's not like fortnite was an incredibly original game when it came out either um so i'm following this alex that's um, i'm following them but i'm gonna not follow alex um we're gonna go and check this roof out if we can't get oh we got a is that a sniper a stellar wind i don't know if i've gotten that one before yeah this is a sniper rifle if we can get ourselves a decent scope then it could be quite valuable could be a good gun um you can definitely get pretty competitive with your teammates that's something maybe i don't like about this game is that uh, okay apparently you can mark out enemies that's that's an interesting thing i have not known about uh you know, like i've definitely had you know teammates steal upgrades right in front of me as i'm trying to go for them and i've also st stolen upgrades from other teammates it must be said like i i think that the game makes the player in a sense and it, it's you know like it's going to condone certain habits and um there's nothing preventing you or uh, condemning you from doing something like that outside of your teammates um yelling at you very angrily in voice chat which i have promptly turned off for this video which i think is is only the highest of wisdom all of our all of my teammates are hanging out very far away from me so i've got a an ability called disturb each character has basically an ulti i guess there's you could say that um the game mashes some like overwatch or like moba-esque moba-ish stuff oh ouch i have found that people will tend to do that little jump Did they just like disappear there for a moment? I'm gonna go ahead and grab their stuff. Uh, I'm pretty low. Oh, I guess only my shields took damage there. Um, I got a frantic. I don't know if I want a frantic. Is this just a shotgun? Uh oh. Someone else is here. Okay. Um. <clears throat> Hold on a second. Oh, I don't have any. Oh, I do have some recovery shields. Nice. Got our shields back. Uh, my teammates have been dying while I've been dirtling around. Yeah, I'll, I'll notice quite often that um, teammate or people will do, do this like really high maintenance bouncing around with a jetpack. And then when they land, they're just kind of dead in the water. So I just take my shot when they land and um, it doesn't really matter too much. Ooh, almost got a nifty headshot there. I guess almost doesn't really matter. Yep, yeah, that's that. Instant respawn though. A new has arrived. 
but like I said, you know, it's it does a good job of making sure that you know you didn't queue for nothing. Do kind of you do respawn with nothing though is the only thing you you lose your guns and stuff. Um, so that's kind of a bummer, but you know. Okay, I have dropped into uh, quite a hot zone here. Wait, oh god! So that's an ability that gravitates people towards you or towards it. Oh, that wasn't bad. You can't actually destroy it. Nice. Got some stuff back. Oh, God. Okay, um, let's restore our shield. Here he comes. There you go. <clears throat> Not bad. Ouch. Let's restore our shield. Okay, reload. Here he comes. There's two of them. Ah, that was that was that. Okay, I mean that's that's pretty good. Game's fun. Uh, apparently, I got MVP. I don't think that counts for anything except letting your teammates know that they didn't do as well as you. Got some stuff. So, I mean, uh, let's talk. Uh, let's talk some of the predatory stuff here. Um, I definitely I wish I could say that this game is better um, when it comes to its monetization and it's um, you know capitalizing on FOMO it's not it's it's as bad as any other game it's got like you know loot crates and whatever this is and that's it's got weapon skins it's got some kind of storefront which is really indiscernible like i don't know what this is i can play some kind of gotcha sure play it yeah we'll get the thing did you did we get the thing did, uh, no we didn't uh oh looks like i'm gambling now um do we get you know let's go to you know we've got a rank system what does this mean season rewards did i play enough of the thing did i collect enough of the thing I don't know who could say does any of this make sense uh, we got heroes you can unlock them with currency i don't have enough guess i better spend some money um it's a nightmare uh what's this over here i was looking through this and i was like what does any of this mean achievements okay those come with rewards did i get some did i get some rewards i don't know hard to say what, what does any of this mean? Uh, account link, do do the thing. Um, you know, I just uh, admissions. Um, so we got a battle pass here, maybe, and I don't even know if you can buy a battle pass. I think it's one of the few things that this game does well is maybe it doesn't have a battle pass, but still, this is like encouraging you to play more of the game which i don't think is necessarily a bad thing but on top of everything oh yeah okay sorry we do have a battle pass yeah okay never mind <laughs> uh, uh i guess uh you know i really walked into that one apparently i've earned a bunch of stuff in said battle pass oh yeah there it is upgrade the superior battle pass to get this too how much is that how much did i get it spend 500 to upgrade or, and get 530 gems uh, how much how much is this are you gonna show my credit card insufficient diamonds good okay we got nice uh, fun currencies all right I will say this at the very least and I'm really I think I'm being very forgiving here is at least the the, the thing cost 500 diamonds and you can buy 500 diamonds you know, at least it's got that going for it. It gives you 500 plus 50. So at the end of the day, it's still doing the thing that I hate. I hate this so, so much. And I don't think any game should ever be forgiven for this is that you have your stupid 
Fruit Loops money. Like I've got 1500 Fruit Loops and the, the thing costs 1450, which leaves me with 50 Fruit Loops and I can't buy anything with 50 Fruit Loops. So now I'm just stuck with this extra currency forever until of course I am encouraged to buy more Fruit Loops and yeah, it's just it just keeps the, the, the feedback loop going or the fruit loop <laughs> The feedback fruit loop um thing going I hate it. I hate it so much and I will never I will never forgive whoever started this trend probably it was valve if I'm being honest, but I hate it truly um, actually, I think Valve is it's one of the few things Valve does well is like like you buy keys and yeah Okay, keys are a currency if you're like in some kind of weird black market But for the most part you just buy the thing with money with actual money not like itchy and scratchy money. So um, Yeah, I can't I can't apologize enough for this game when it comes to its predatory monetization it's it, it is following the playbook and i don't like that however um what i am going to do <laughs> all the same uh is i'm going to put my in like invite link in the description but what i'll do um is i'm going to put a regular steam link to the store page so you can check this game out if if it looks like something you want to play and I think that if you are into battle royales and you're looking for a new one, this one is worth your time, despite all of my complaints. Um, so I'm gonna put a, just a plain link to the Steam store page, and I'm also gonna put in my invite link. If you wanna click on that one, um, then maybe I get an extra thing, I don't know. Um, who can say? I don't even think, I, I don't even know if I'm gonna do that, because honestly, I don't know how much of this game I'm gonna be playing, but for now, I think it's pretty fun. I find it pretty, pretty cool. I like the gunplay. I like the guns. I like the variety. I like the characters. I like, I even like some of the character designs, although I find them to be a little bit, I don't know, we're, we're reaching this weird stage when it comes to certain games where it's like we have everything in the kitchen sink. Like there's actually like no cohesive style like we've got a scientist with a robot with uh whatever you know a, a pizza delivery girl with a cop you know like we've got so many different styles that at the end of the day we have no styles you know when you have every single style you actually have no style and it ends up being kind of generic and you know like it, it also just straight up looks like fortnite i mean I'm who's you know, you're kidding yourself if you if you don't You know think that it isn't just completely ripping off Fortnite um, And I'm cool with that because I, I kind of hate Fortnite with a passion, but um, You know, so my stance is like yeah, like it's not like Fortnite was original rip off Fortnite if you can do a couple of things original or if you can just like be a fun or a compelling alternative then yeah i'm cool with it go ahead uh, have fun i'll have fun I'll, I'll 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 jump in i'm not gonna i'm not gonna spend any money i, I think that um there is something to be said there, sh there there should be a word about the fact that it's free to play is actually kind of a bad thing um and the reason being is that uh, i haven't encountered any cheaters yet or any hackers yet i have me personally have not en uh, encountered that but it's only a matter of time because whenever a free-to-play competitive game comes out any competitive game like we're talking like i don't know uh, like blues clues the competitive mmo or something like that like something really truly juvenile um there's always like 30 hackers day one who want to be on the top leaderboard for the blues clues game like like blues clues plays go fish and there's hackers if you're if you hack like if you if you like if you're watching this now for some reason and you you hack any game please know that i i truly think you're one of the lowest life forms on this planet and that's below like some truly despicable people but like 
there's like vile villainous evil in this world and then there's like hacking a little competitive game because you you want to get you know uh, uh, your your number to go higher like it's completely meaningless i can't i do not understand it but anyway without being too spicy you I know mean, we're gonna be we're all be a little bit spicy apparently um i'm gonna go i'm gonna you know my, my teammates are dying and like i say maybe uh maybe i earn my karma in the sense that i, I never help my teammates I, I i try to help my teammates i won't lie oh we have a shotgun i don't want a shotgun what is this what what is, oh mad rat mad rat's okay yeah it's i like a semi semi fire a new reaper has arrived uh is this a shotgun god damn why do i have so many shotguns all right we'll 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 try our shotgun uh okay i've killed the reaper Oh god. All right, good time for this. Wow, that was not a good camera angle. My dude. Okay. Nice. All right, well, hopefully I'm in a good position to revive. Let's let me do let me be the good I want to see in the world. Oh god damn it. Yeah, I thought that was gonna happen. And like you know, okay, I guess reviving is is um takes a lot longer than helping a player up, but I definitely think that there should be a bit more in the game to you know encourage people to help each other out. Cause it right now it just feels like a bummer it feels like a real bummer um helping a teammate out feels like a chore that you are like guilted into doing rather than actually encouraged to doing Ugh. why am i going back in here this is only gonna get me killed Um, yeah, this is such a bad idea. Why? Well, I, I keep trying to lean. Oh, God. Yeah, that was awful. Awful, awful, awful. I had, uh, that gun was not great because I didn't really spend enough time scrounging for something better. I was really trying. I was really trying to do the right thing and, uh, help my teammate out. And it just seems like bad play. Um, yeah, we got, we got all the things. I'll do one more. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. It's addictive like i i actually kind of like playing this game almost understand the last like five how many years have we been doing battle royales now not 10 years it can't be 10 years at least five i think we've got to be like how many seasons is fortnite in now five years but like fortnite fortnite was really kind of like the end of the uh arc in a lot of ways Because we had um, we had Arma, which led to Daisy, which led to things like um, HIZ. What was it called? Uh, Z outbreak. I don't know. Um, there were, and then there was like Daisy battle royales. Then um, there's so many bad battle royales that people played just because the battle royale genre, like, it was cursed in a way because every it seemed like every company wanted to make one but they wanted to make it so fast that they didn't really take the time let's try this character i haven't tried them before take the time to have like decent gunplay so there was just a, so many bad battle royales that people played for lack of anything better 
and then uh pub was seemed to be like the first decent one the first one that had like actually pretty okay gunplay i personally don't like it but um i understand why people like it and then pub pubg's um popularity seemed to be kind of like rug pulled by uh fortnite because fortnite i love to remind people the fact that fortnite was going to be a zombie survival game at one point hence why it was called fortnite it was like you had to survive two weeks uh under the invasion of zombies remember that why it was even called fortnite because you were building a fort and instead it became uh the most successful and popular battle royale of all time and debatably even one of the most popular games of all time outside of roblox roblox if you didn't know is one of the most popular games and platforms for games of all time I don't know if you knew that something i like to remind people of in order to humble them whenever someone gets hot to try when it comes to a triple a game even something like a, an elden ring which is you know my personal jam i, I like me an elden ring oh, the biggest game triple a game one of the best you know most popular game call of duty one of the most popular dude roblox if you think that it holds a candle to roblox you are kidding yourself and I just love that, you know, things like Minecraft and Roblox. Um, I don't know if this is still true, but for the longest time, also some of the most popular games ever conceived were actually like <clears throat> Barbie games, which I'm not saying that out of descent. There's just like for the longest time, there were not enough um, games kind of pitched towards uh you know a, a feminine clientele there just weren't for the longest time and so uh it, it there was just like a, a huge a range of like barbie games or dream house games or like dollhouse games sims obviously is like one of those games where it's like yeah um it's not like uh stereotypically a feminine game but like absolutely it is pitched to it was pitched towards a different market and that would it was one of the most popular games of all time still is well no maybe not as much anymore i do see that there are some interesting um competitors why am i playing this game i don't know i really i liked it and that was enough i don't like this gun I, I do not like this gun. It it re, it, it ne I need a better magazine for this gun. It is kind of kind of garbage. Someone in my comments. Maybe you're kind of garbage. Yeah, you're not wrong. I don't know what my super ability is. You know what I do like though. I like an ump. Can we change? Oh, an M4. Oh yeah. Wait a minute. I haven't tried the generator. Oh yeah. This is this is decent. I like this. Let's try it. Let's do uh, swap out the assault rifle, the M4 or the, the VSS for an, um, an M4. That's going to mean we have two assault rifles, which kind of sucks. That means we're sharing ammo between them. It's good to have a uh, weapon variety. <clears throat> Let's uh, use the generator, though. Apparently, I'm losing my voice. I ought to figure out what button it is to um, do callouts. It's the only thing I'm not really doing. And I can't, I shouldn't really talk about um, not, you know, team, team play not being encouraged when I'm not even doing the bare minimum. <clears throat> I do find like, you know, teams, well, one thing they do do in this game is uh, they kind of are encouraged to group together. I've definitely found that teams will tend not to want to split apart, which is, you know, something. 
Okay, 400 capsular XP. I don't really know what the XP does. I think it like um, gradually increases the damage of your weapons. Or your ammo damage. Yeah, I, I see that in the bottom right. I'm not sure what that means. Not sure what the X, the shield XP does either. Walked right by this uh, chest there, dude. Oh my god, I... I I was walking around with, like, a completely empty magazine that whole time. It's embarrassing. Yeah, I mean, I... I can't really... I don't really have much more to say about this game. It, it just hits... Hits the dopamines. Hits a lot of the dopamines. I honestly thought that was my teammate. I saw his name, like, behind them. Nice. Give me, let me have the stuff, dude. I, I got, I mean, it was a team effort for sure. <laughs> Lots of nice stuff over here. Um, the jetpack has a pretty long cooldown, but there is a character that, uh, what do you mean shield is full? Oh, I guess it's my health that is lacking. Uh, there's a character that gets a faster, re uh, cool, uh, you know, less low cooldown on their jetpack. We should I should show off more of the vehicles. It's one of the actual like novelties of this game. Let's jump in a vehicle. These do run out of ammo. It's not a big deal. Um, this is cool. Like, I, I like this little mech walker. It has a dash, which is kind of neat. Um, I like the little Gatling gun. Wow, I, I did not hit him at all with this thing, huh? Okay, let's, uh, I'm gonna... They'll, they'll kill that guy. I'm gonna walk over here. There's, I think, a bit more of an interesting vehicle over here that we should check out. There's also a couple of lads over there. I'm definitely a bit more aggressive in this game. Okay, this is a shotgun. This has got a jump, and it's also uh, got a, like a shotgun attack, which is kind of fun. But it, the range is obviously not great. This one's actually, this is one of the faster uh, vehicles, once it gets going. Wow, I'm, I'm like doing horribly right now. Um, some people can like shoot you off the vehicle, but also the, the vehicle has its own health. There we go. Um, uh, can I... Oh, I haven't tried... Oh yeah, you can uh, recover your shield and like health and stuff while you're in the vehicle. That's kind of cool. But yeah, let's check out this, uh, the speed on this vehicle. It can, you can really get up there. One of the faster ones for sure. And I think that the, that's like, that's intentional because it's a shock, it's got a shotgun, right? So you want to, um, you want to get right up in people's grill quickly. But also, it's just, like, kind of fun to zoom around. Oh, and this one's got a jump as well. Um, this is a drop done by one of the players. One of my teammates? No, actually, no. Never mind. Someone else, then. Um, there's a specific character that can do support drops. Which is kind of cool. Oh, um, do we want to do... I have three guns. When did that happen? I didn't mean to jump in this. I meant to pick up the uh, scope. So what did that go on? The one on my M4? Can I? Yeah, I didn't get all the stuff. Let's, uh... Whew! Yeah, that's cool. Um, oh. And actually, it's got quite a fast cooldown.
Ooh, he did a nifty little jump into that building there. That was actually pretty slick. My teammate jumped right in there. Gonna grab this. I don't know. I like. I really don't have anything more to say about this game specifically. But I, I'm just, I'm enjoying it. Like I'm having fun with it, which is like more than I can say for so many other battle royales. Like I tried Apex, and you know what? Skill issue. I don't care. Get out of here. Who cares? Skill issue or not, I didn't enjoy a lot of the other battle royales. But I'm enjoying this one, so I don't know. Maybe it's just because it's early and this game is uh, doesn't have like the ridiculously skilled player base yet. And I am also very early in the rank, like I'm, you know, silver. So I'm sure. Ooh, got a, we got a. Oh, he's got a laser beam. Whoa. Looks like I, I killed him. Like if you kill the, the, the vehicle, you kill them as well. That's kind of cool. Um, let's recover our health. And I, I, I seem to have two different kinds of shield upgrades. Let's see what that looks like. And I actually don't know what that means. Oh God. Yo, lad, I'm trying to do something here. Hold on. What does this do? Uh, shield is already full. Okay, well, whatever. We're coming, kind of coming down to the wire here. Our squad is doing well. Ah, oh, there's a lad over there. Oh. He's got a really beefy shield. Okay. Ah, damn it. Um. Whoa. Get out of there. I, I would say I would. Oh, okay. That guy is, is it recover or I can't tell if um, the person he's helping is like downed or dead. If it's, if he's dead, that means it's going to take him quite a long time to bring him back. But it looks like our teammates are actually going the extra mile and then bringing me back. Oh, heck yeah, bud. Come on. Let's go. As they say, as the kids, they do scream in uh, coherently into their uh bad microphones let's go come on i'm alive i didn't think i would be alive i'm 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 pretty excited wait where's all my stuff oh no oh is that all my stuff i lost like all of my stuff Is that all my stuff? I think this is like all of it. I guess I don't need a better. Well, you know what? I wouldn't mind having a four scope. Oh, does that? Can I not put a four scope on? Oh, I can. Yeah. There you go. We got a four scope on the M4. Um. Okay. Ten and six. I'm not sure. Oh, that's. I think that's how many people I've killed. There is a way to tell how many squads are left, but I'm not sure what it is. So we're just gonna, we're gonna mosey. I'm seeing other people struggle with lag. Not sure if it's me or not. Oh, okay. We've got a... This is, seems like highly unuseful. Um, I need my shield back. 
I will help them in a second. Oh, that's a vehicle. Whoops. Uh, I'm definitely being carried this match. 100% acknowledge that. Hey, a better shield. Um, our circle is like almost here. I would like to stay in the circle. They're like fighting right on the fringe. They're going to be behind it soon enough. Guys, if you die past that circle, I can't help you. I do have a defense thing. I have not used that at all. Okay, that's a bombardment. Why are you running through that, friend? You deserve that, 100%. I'll help you, but still. If you're looking for a rescue, I'm your man. Someone in the lake, which I could be killing right now. Careful, guys. There you go. Nice. This guy's got a sniper. It's that vehicle there that's doing that. You can, uh, I mean, you can definitely destroy it. It's gonna take a little while. Is, are you okay? No, you're not okay. Well, I guess there is a little bit of encouragement. Um, you know, you get missions and stuff completed for saving your friends. So we're probably... This is the last circle. There's no way. This is a pretty tiny circle. How many squads are left? I, I'm, sure, I'm sure that information is somewhere, but it's going to be really hard to tell. There's so much going on on the UI. And honestly, this game's like, they probably slimmed down the UI a little bit from other games, other battle rails that have just like a, a immense amount of information dump. More ammo, can always use more ammo. Ah. Okay, something. Yes! What a good way to end the, the the video. Heck yeah, bud. Heck yeah, bud. And I'm the MVP. You know, that feels pretty good. Heck yeah. Uh, you know, amongst uh, golds and plats, so maybe I'm not that bad. They also, they did really well to support each other. That was actually really decent. What a, what a good game to end on. So yeah, I, I don't know. Uh, as I say, what I'm going to do, um, I, I like to try and have some kind of ethical code when it comes to these kind of games, is I will put my invite code in the description, but I'm also going to put in my, just a, a plain link to the Steam Store page so you can try and you know check it out for yourself. See if it's your kind of thing. Um, I tentatively recommend this game. I recommend it if you're into battle royales. Um, and right now it's good. Uh, could it be bad tomorrow? Sure. Um, but it's for now it's fun. I like it. So uh, it's uh, a glowing recommendation for me in terms uh, from the perspective of, uh, you know, battle royales in general. So yeah this game is called far light 84 still don't know why have no idea why they called it that but never mind um if you've enjoyed this video definitely hit that like button and consider subscribing for more content like this i'll see you guys next time take it easy